Welcome back. This still doesn't look all that interesting here. Ooh, but I look a lot more interesting than I did before. I forgot about that. Are you interesting today? Oh yeah, what does that entail? West area. Oh yeah. Also near that atoll. Well, I don't think there is. I don't know where the atoll is, but it's presumably near some land. But I guess we'll just go to where they tell us to go precisely. Might move the boat slightly closer to where we've already been, so that we can avoid creating any holes in what we've explored. I don't want to come back out here. Oh man, just ocean everywhere. Is there somewhere like this? Okay. Curious what kind of wildlife we'll encounter out on the boat while we're this far out. I have no idea. I'm also curious what kind of view we'll have. Up here. It's actually kind of cool how, how on the lines in the distance now. Anyways, I guess we'll just get going. There is something to see here, whatever it is. Presumably whale sharks, I guess. So I imagine it'll be pretty deep out here. I'm curious what the environment's gonna be like this far out. This is definitely the furthest we've been out by a decent margin. Okay. So let's start with the familiar areas. Are you familiar? I'm sure you are. No, you're not. Let me rub you. I'm not sure how large I really consider your head to be, considering other things I've seen before. These rays are everywhere. They like being poked. to where we've been before. Somewhere over here, vaguely. I don't want to check my map constantly or anything, but... I always raise. Jeez. You want to look at... You want to fill in the map here. Make sure you get to see everything there is to see. Have I seen you before? Yes. You're apparently golden, I'm not sure I agree with that. Actually, wait, you're a young one. Have I seen a young one before? I haven't. Why, have I only seen young ones? It's actually kind of weird. There we go. I don't know how you get the third piece of information. Hi, shark. I 
How did I unlock that other other piece of information there? Why are these all kids? This is a surprisingly shallow part though for how far our, far out we are. Although I say that we're actually relatively close to the coast here. Lots of sharks though. It's interesting how you start to see the same fish everywhere. Moon aligned fish. I want to see you. I've seen quite a few parrot fish in my time. Alright, so let's hug the coast here and then we'll start really exploring. I almost wish I could just see better what the precise border was. This guy's got a pretty slow... I, I guess that's part of diving, but this guy's got a pretty slow breathing rate for being engaged in physical activity right now. Never thought much about that. So over here is about the border of where we've been before. Oh god, steep drop off. But I'm kind of curious, is there anything- Whoa! Use those mackerel. I guess if we'll see anything up here. I feel like there are some places where you will actually only see certain fish. Specifically in really open spots like this, where you're really high up. Is there a parrotfish near me? Let's try not to retread what we've done too much. I do also wish you could just move with the map up, but oh well. If you have autosum on and you, whoa, starting to lose the ability to see things. What is that? One second. If you bring the map up while you're autosumming, you uh, stop seeing anything. Why is it so dark there? There's just like this mist, almost. So I'm just deeper? I think it's just because I'm so deep. What, what is my elevation? I'm fairly deep. I guess it's just the the depth. The sun is so little light. It's weird though, it's like I just saw a wall all of a sudden. You know the kind of shark I'm looking for. Why are there so many different kinds of sharks named after other sh other animals? Is this a different crevice? No, this is the same crevice as before. <laughs> now I get creepy music. Calm down with the creepy game. We're not going there today. Oh, we'll just hear some creepy sounds for a little bit now, I guess. No matter. I don't think that'll play forever, since I'm not actually up there. The serious thing to me is that that music starts playing again once you leave the crevice, as well. I 
in this case, once I'm actually far away from it again. Is there any kind of interesting cave or something here? No? The indentation there looked suspicious to me. Alright. Scary music over. More butterfly fish. More dolphin. And they all make the same sound. Uh, can I actually reach them? I can almost reach you. No, I must not. Generic meta ray. No other dolphin. I'm a whistle, don't I? I don't know if they like you just. Yeah, they do like you playing your whistle. I should have tried that with the other one. Spindle shaped, my favorite shape. Hold on, there's other stuff here I wanted to see. Oh, that's just a hammerhead. Yep. Where are you, dolphins? Oh. I don't know if it's just just rub a bunch or poke them or something. Or if the main thing to do is to. is to play the whistle. I don't know if they would care about me drawing things. I can also feed them, of course. Kind of silly, you just do whatever with a pen and some fish like it, but... I, I, it's my impression that it's usually the deep sea fish that like that. The ones real in the dark. I still don't quite get the secret here. I, I'm more aware of my full repertoire of things to make fish like me, but I'm not quite sure what to make this one do. Rather than just maybe rubbing a lot. I don't quite remember what it is that actually indicates that they're partnerized in the first place. I get some happy sparkles from them if I rub them a lot. Some things like being poked. Not most though, I don't think. They like me whistling initially. Doesn't seem to do much now. Again, that's not a part of the game that I have that much interest in, so I'm not too worried about it. Anyways. Let's see if there's anything else new to see over here. There's a bit of a middle section here we've, we've left off. Yeah, I guess the visibility actually changes the deeper you get, which is a nice detail. How far you can see. But it is kind of weird how sometimes just all of a sudden you can't see anything. You're in this big open place and yet you can't actually tell where you are in it. One thing, one reason I do keep looking at the map is it is actually really easy to get disoriented end up going in circles or something. Especially when the visibility is this low. So, 
Oh, who? It's not to say someday I want to see something in one of these. Okay, the place I have to click is not where. There we go. Identify yourself. Yes, yours. Let's put two burns in And these little eyes again. Cool. So to say, one day I'm gonna find something in one of those. Where are you? I'm getting stuck on stuff for some reason. Kopi. Explosion of color. A literal explosion. Not sure about that part. And this is in this game from like 2007 or 8. I don't think people were using the word literal that way back then. What is more literal is that I think we're done for today. So I think I'll see you next time when we do more exploration. Because there's a lot more water to see out here on this trip. If we can even cover all this ground. How much air we have. And maybe we won't, I don't know. But eventually we'll have some whales to see. Presumably. Bye everyone.